Hey guys, what's up? I'm Greg, he's Q, together with Mr. Happy 0121, and today we're doing not one, but two reviews. Two reviews. We are reviewing the watermelon Pop-Tarts and the maple bacon. A normal reviewer would only inflict one of these upon <laughs> themselves, but not us. We're going to do two. Are you pumped? I'm pumped. All right, back from the birthday, doing two reviews in one. We're going to start with the maple bacon. We are going to put it in the microwave. Yes, in the microwave, because that is my preferred method of heating up the Pop-Tarts. Why, you ask? You don't get the brown corners that way. We're going to throw this in the microwave, and we'll be right back. Here's your close-up. The little red sprinkles, I'm assuming, are supposed to be bacon. And then you get your maple interior. Yum, yum. Going with the maple bacon first. It's a little little low light in here today. It's kind of yeah, intimate. It it's like we're in a the back of an Italian restaurant. Oh, yeah. For some reason, this evoked the memory. I hate soap operas. I hate them because of the lighting. It's always like dark. It looks like this, but darker. I hate it so much. That's the one thing besides the horrible acting that always just filled me with disgust with those. You know what bothers me about soap operas now? What? Is they're super, super, super high def. They're so high def, it feels fake. Oh, I know what you mean. It freaks me out, man. All right. Before we bite into this, please give this video a like. Let us know you're out there. They're getting better about giving us our views, but we still love the likes. He's going to lose that corner before it ever hits his face. Here we go. Bite two. One more. Let me say this before we go too far. One of my great joys in life is the maple bacon donuts that I bring home sometimes. Maple donut with actual pieces of bacon on top. Very awesome, right? Very awesome. Now, what's your opinion of this? Not very awesome. No, it tastes like, it just tastes like syrup that had a lot of bacon in it, but you're not, oh, it was not good. This is a D. A D. A D. And you did say maple bacon syrup, didn't you? Yeah. Before I give my grade. You know what may make this better? Some bacon syrup. Bacon, maple bacon syrup for your maple bacon Pop-Tart. After we do this, I'll give my grade. Let's see if this improves it any. Shall we? Yeah. All right, here we go. Nope. Didn't hurt it. All right, my grade. A D and a B plus. It is what I thought it was. But it was still pretty damn good. The front end of it, when you when it first goes in, you get like this burnt bacon taste. But the the back half of that is the payoff. The maple is the most mapley flavored maple I've ever had. Maple, maple, maple. I like this. I, I don't know if after I ate a box of them if I would like it. I don't know like if I eat one more if I'd like it. But at this moment, I like it way more than I should have. And it's not on the strength of the bacon, what like you would think, because I enjoy bacon. No, it's on the strength of the maple flavor. And I, I'm not even a big maple fan, if there is such a thing. <laughs> there is such a thing, I'm sure. So, my pronunciation, B+. Plus. Now we're moving to the watermelon, which, in my view, is the one I'm excited about. Oh, me too. For whatever reason, when I've been discussing this with people, the idea of a watermelon Pop-Tart really turns people's stomach. You know, there's a... a a yellow watermelon. I did not know that. Yeah, you that cut into it. That sounds gross. And the part that's red is actually yellow. Well, it tastes the same, apparently. I've never had a yellow watermelon, but... Much like everything, I don't really want to eat the actual fruit. I just want the flavor. Oh, watermelon's pretty good, though. Kind of like strawberry. Love the flavor of strawberry. Have no interest in eating a strawberry. Watermelon flavor, yes. Seeds, no. All right? Into the microwave. And in case you're wondering... It doesn't take very long to microwave a Pop-Tart. If you're doing it at a uh, high temperature or regular whatever, 10 seconds. Don't go any longer. That filling will burn your tongue. 
I go 30 seconds at half power. Watermelon Pop-Tart. You get more of your traditional Pop-Tart filling with this one. It looks right. I hate to doom anything, but you know going in, this was the one I expected to like, and I already liked the other one. This Pop-Tart is probably screwed. Let's we'll give see. it a shot. Here we go. Before we take this second bite, I want to take a quick moment to say thanks to Tom Cody, who recently featured us in his favorite YouTubers video. I saw it. He did. You know, I told him we would make the same video, but it would be like 30 seconds long with intro and outro. So, like, yeah. Yeah. We'll save you the, the video. We enjoy the endorsement. We enjoy Tom Cody. We enjoy Peep This Out. And then Reckless Eating. Credits. Last bite. You know, I think I have a future as a fortune teller of sorts. Some things I've recently been correct about. The movie Concussion has only made back half of what it cost to make the movie. Will Smith, no Oscar nomination. Sylvester Stallone, Oscar nominated for Creed today. Good job, buddy. I think somebody sit here and called this around Christmas, said, ain't nobody wants to see that. You want to make a sports movie, make people feel good. Nobody wants to see you throw on some hibbity-dibbity accent and talk about head injuries. We could pick up, like, Newsweek or something. We don't need it. And much like I was right about that, I was right about this Pop-Tart. I do not care for it. That tastes... Does it? What you like about watermelon, and I'll tell you, this is a melon... Does not translate to pastry. Melon plus pastry equals nah. <laughs> or as, like, you know, a normal person would say, hell to the nah. C minus. D. D? D. Gun to your head, which one's better? I, I want to say the maple bacon's better. <laughs> All right. So, so I guess I'd give this a D minus and the maple <laughs> bacon a D plus. So then it's like the choice of being shot or stabbed. Yeah. All right. Shot, by the way. Maple bacon for the win. Rather be shot. Here's what I always say about this kind of thing. This was $2. You owe it to yourself to eat a box of maple bacon Pop-Tarts before you die. Same with the watermelon. That's why they make these in their legit limited. Because they know there's a curiosity factor. But then once you get beyond that... It's garbage. It's not good. This, there, like everything else, though, there's going to be somebody that the watermelon is their favorite ever. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. The blue raspberry that we did over on the oh. other channel one time, just kind of like these, was amazing. And to this day, I say is amazing. You never know till you try. I tried the watermelon. Did not enjoy it. Watermelon soda is good. Yeah. Yeah. Watermelon like Jolly Ranchers. Watermelon oh, lots of things. Pushing it with the watermelon Jolly Ranchers. Watermelon pastry. And, you know, that's being kind to a Pop-Tart to call it a pastry. Not so much. As we're making this video today, we're at 45,900-ish subscribers. Wow. Getting close to 46. Just want to take a moment to say thank you. You know, we say it all the time whenever we hit close to 1,000. We're getting close. Hopefully sometime soon we'll, we'll get the other 100. But thank you for watching. We appreciate it. We do. I, going along with the thank you theme, I want to give three shout-outs. I'm going to give the first one the Mercedes TX 1999. Now, that could be for Mercedes Texas and their birth date, or it could just be whatever. Mercedes TX 1999, who also shares a January 13th birthday, much like you. Oh, that's, that's cool. So, happy belated birthday. Two Facebook shout-outs are Facebook. Now over 230 likes. Anthony Duhat, or do that. It's D-O-U-T-H-A-T. Duhat. Let us know, Anthony. Tyler Robinson. I think I got that one. I think so. Tyler's going to be coming back and he's going to be like, no, it's, it's Robinson. I'm going to go with Robinson, Tyler. Taylor. Yeah. Taylor <laughs> Robinson. Sorry, man. I went with the popular Tyler Robinson. Got anything else to add? No. Going to be a busy weekend. We plan on doing a video today, tomorrow, and Sunday. What are we going to review? I don't have a damn clue. You know, we could have spread this Pop-Tart thing out over two days, but why? 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 
I, I figure getting it out of the way is all good. Why prolong it? Why prolong the agony? Plus, you kind of get a little comparison. And we both agree that if you're just going to buy one, bacon maple. Bacon maple. All right. As always, as we said earlier, thank you so much for watching. We really appreciate it. You can find us on all social media. We enjoy doing it. And we try our best to be really active. I think we're most active anymore on like Facebook and Instagram because Instagram's really easy. Oh, yeah. yeah. So there we are. Until next time, stay vigilant. We're off to go watch some Entourage.